about how to create a BMI calculator, right? This is a very simple app where um, we'll be just creating a calculator, right? So BMI calculator, what is BMI, right? BMI is um, body mass index, okay? So we just will calculate body mass index, okay? So how to do that is basically you'll just, uh, you'll just have to use a formula where you, you just have to divide weight with height multiplied by height, okay? So it's very simple. And what is BMI? What is body mass index? So generally, a uh, body mass index is measured to know whether a person is overweight, normal weight, or underweight, yeah, obese. So we can get to know all of these things uh, with BMI calculator. And let's quickly check out how to do that, right? This is going to be very much helpful. So first, for that, you have to search for BMI chart, okay? So BMI chart, let's click on images. Let's see if we can get something. Let's check this out. Okay. Okay, uh, I, I think this is good. This is good, right? So we have all the values and uh, so if the value of BMI is less than 18.5, then the person is underweight. If it is uh, between these, 18.5 to 24.9, then he's normal. 25 to 29.9, then he's overweight. 30 to 34.9, obese. Greater than 35, extremely obese. Okay. So I'll just quickly save this image as, or why to save it? We can just use the address, right? Copy image address. So we'll use it later. First, we have to style the screen, yeah? So let's rename the screen as BMI calculator. Then let's give a background color for this. So I'm just gonna give a gray color. Hmm. Or let's give this maybe a lighter color. I think this shade should work. Hmm. I like it. Okay. So yeah, after giving background color, we have to give vertical alignment space around. Then I just want to add a label. This is a title label. So I'll just write title label. The title will be BMI calculator. And font size will be 35. Cool. So color, I hope I shall be giving white. White as in suit, dark gray. Cool, this is good. So make it bold. So first make it italic then make it bold then let's give some padding left 10 pixel padding right 10 pixel padding okay so if you've not been watching my pre previous videos yet please do go back to my channel and do watch all of them right and we've been discussing about margins and paddings in our uh, multiple videos right please do go back to my channel and check out those videos only then you'll understand about margins and paddings and differences between them okay so then come back here to get started with this again so i'm just giving a border let's say border radius is four color lighter way better nice so after the title label we will be needing an image like i wanted to show the bmi chart so so the let's let's just take the image just grabbing one here we all know it just goes up so we have to place it down here and you can style this image so first rename this image as a bmi image okay and picture just paste it 
then height and width manually uh, i'll just place it so height can be 250 okay width can be 300 better right so let's give a border so let's give three pixel border four pixel radius then color dark gray color cool next after the image we actually need um, so what do we need after the image is we want to input boxes right because we have to take in width sorry weight right and we have to take in height of the user so weight in kgs and height in meters that's how it works okay so let's just um, get a label not label sorry input so i'm just placing it here and this will be weight input okay so let's click on rename and let's write weight text input so weight in kgs okay this is all let's duplicate this then this will be height text input okay so instead of writing weight you just can write height so this will be height in meters height in meters okay so weight in kgs and height in meters and we need a label to show right so i'm just duplicating this label okay so let's duplicate this label let's get this label and place it under height text input and then let's change the font size to 20. i think this is good instead of naming this as title label then we can name this as result or BMI label, okay? I'm not just giving any text over here for now. It will be empty. I hope we are done with the design, right? What else we need? So we just need weight, height. When you divide them, you should get the result over here, okay? So this is all. Let's quickly um, go to blocks and let's just um, do the calculation, right? Okay. So design is done so let's go to blocks over here whenever oh there should be a button right so with button we can trigger the thing so just grabbing a button over here placing it over here renaming this as bmi button or calculate button calc button then calculate bmi I'm at A here. Then, then let's change font size to 20. Cool. So let's change the background colors to, I think I will choose this color. Cool. And then font bold, of course. Font italic, of course. Raised, obviously. <laughs> and then with so let's change it to four let's give light gray color solid i like this then then we have to go to blocks so when bmi calculator or calculate button click right so when calculate button is clicked we have to apply the formula for bmi here right so what is the formula is weight divided by height square okay weight divided by height square means weight divided by height into height okay weight in kgs and height in meters okay so we have to set it on the bmi label right so i'm just grabbing one set bmi's text to so we have to apply the formula go to math get division then get multiplication place it in here so we are getting weight from weight text inputs text then you can duplicate it 
this here let's place this here so this will be height text input and height text input so weight divided by height into height that's how it is okay so weight text inputs text means whatever you're entering in the text input box that will be given here okay similar goes with the height also right let's quickly check this out Hmm, okay, so the image doesn't really look good because half of it is gone. I think I'll just change the width of the image. So let's calculate first weight in kgs. Let's say I'm giving 60 kgs, okay. Height in meters, let's say 1.5 meters. Calculate BMI, it's 26.6. Oh my god, overweight person is overweight okay but how will the user know that uh, this is a bmi value here right so we can just give a label where it says bmi and then it should give this also we can round it off right we can round it off uh, to the 26 or at least to one decimal or two decimals right so let's just quickly do all these changes first thing let's go to design Click on this image, then scroll up here with maybe I'll just give 320. Okay. After which we have to go to blocks. So we thought of rounding it off. So to round it off, I'm just using round. Round. So let's attach it here, okay. So using the round function will make it uh, round off the value, okay. Along with rounding it off, right? So we can uh, show BMI behind this, this value, right? So to do that, let's go to text and get this join block. Getting this join block here, attaching this here. So in, instead of hello, we can just say BMI right colon and then give us space so it shows bmi now and then it will show the value okay so let's quickly check this out first hmm, it's it, it just got better but maybe we can still increase the width so let's just give 60 let's give 1.5 calculate it shows BMI and it shows uh, rounded off value. Okay. Okay. So this is cool. Nice. Seems good. Right. Isn't it? So this is all about our today's session where we were creating a BMI calculator. I hope you enjoyed this. So we also like just let's change the image width. Maybe I think I'll give 340. So let's live test it and check again. better at least we can see these values right it's better but not perfect so let's give 360 live test hmm. it's not increasing right let's just do it again yeah yes better not more than this we can go right so yeah i think we can just increase 10 more pixels and check this is gonna be my last try last try whatever it is i should accept it okay so i did not increase the thing so let's do it again yes this was my last try and i think i can't do more than this right so yes, this is going to be it. Okay. BMI calculator, we have this. Yes, I can calculate 60, then 1.5, calculate BMI 27. Cool. So this is how it is, right? We have successfully completed creating a BMI calculator. Okay. So if you have any questions or concerns, you can do let me know in the comment section below. And this, this was how simple it is, right? We just had to have weight and height. 
So weight in kgs and height in meters, that's how you can calculate your BMI instantly, right? So with a very small formula and a very simple code, okay? So this was all about our today's session, guys. I'll, I hope I'll meet you all in the next video again, okay? Till then, I'll take your leave. Bye-bye, guys. Have a great day, all. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please do like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Folks, have. Bye-bye.